Hello there, everyone, and welcome here to the Can Am Pro Series Western Division Round 10 at Gateway Motorsports Park. After this, it'll be three races left till we decide a champion of the West Series yet again. Um, after Gateway, we had we had out to Orange Show Speedway, then All American Speedway, and back to Kern County, where things will be decided on who becomes a champion here in the Western Division. Ramian Fisher, Casey Russell will start on the front row. Manuel Gonzalez and the 18 or the 01 of Leif Barnett behind him as we get you to the commands here. Engines have been fired up here, now getting set to roll off of the grid. And looks like everyone gets going. So, beautiful night here for some short track racing, kind of not really a short track, I wouldn't say, but still should be a fun one to watch. Fisher captures the pole. He's still looking for that first win along with Casey Russell. Both those guys on the front row still looking for their first win on the season. Russell has never won here in the uh, Western Division. Leif Barnett, he is yet to win also. He's behind those guys as they're kind of stacking up back here. Not sure what's going on, but... um, Not sure what's going on right here. Is it's not a lot of room for these guys. It looks like someone doesn't want to make room. Ooh, a bit of contact right there between 39 and the 57. Not sure what's going on. There they go. They, they're able to get back in line now, but as they get ready to come off corner number four here. Getting set to go green for the 10th time this season. Pace car down pit row. The fans are already on their feet. Two Chevys on the front row. Fisher and Russell. Both going to go head to head to try and capture the win and play capture the flag as the green flag waves at Gateway. In the corner, number one, they go. Casey Russell kind of drove it really wide on that corner right there. They're already three wide. Jacob Buhalt's in the 23. Currently sits in the middle right there as Fisher is able to clear for the lead. 18 up to P2. He's going to hunt down that 9. Looking for his second win on the season. Another driver looking for win number 2 to 74. That's race's winner right there. Look at this. They're 3 wide. It's 57 ahead of Williams in the middle. But Fisher comes around and lead lap number 1. 20 laps of racing here at Gateway. Fisher, like I've mentioned, still looking for that first win here on the season. He's finished runner-up so many times. And just got wrecked a bunch of other times. As There's the 23 who kind of Needs a really good um, finish right here, trying to keep up there, trying to stay with um, Christian Russell for the points. As there's Brandon Mayhew in the back, still filling in for Ray Mayhew and the 35. Lord Delano came down on him right there and contact ahead. Lane Sanders in the 70, 37 around. Oh, and he saves it right there from getting into the wall. What a save! But yellow flag is out, nonetheless, here for the first time tonight. Raymond Fisher in the 9 leads the way here early on. As we go back and take a look right here. Oh, Dylan Young and Nunnigan Scott makes contact right there. And look at this. Everyone was able to avoid Sanders and he just turned it right back around and kept going like nothing ain't happened. A great save by the 37 right there. You're going to see Young, uh, Young clips the 40 right there and down into Sanders they went. 44 ba uh, barely able to get by right there, but... Great save for the 37. Yellow flag is out. Raymond Fisher out front. We're going to take a quick break. We'll be back. Welcome back here to Gateway Motorsports Park as we're getting set to go back green. Raymond Fisher is still your race leader. Um, all 17 drivers are still on the track. Fisher leads over Gonzalez, uh, Russell, Mendez, and another Russell. That's Christian Russell in the 38. So, getting set to go back green here. Single file they go, pace car off down pit road. And... Green flag is back out once again. Dylan Young making a move down to the inside of Christian Elder right there. So 18 running a bit lower than Fisher, trying to get up there to that race lead. He also has Russell right there behind him. Russell now makes a move, or actually that's Mendez who makes him move down to the inside. In the corner three they go. 
Three wide for second place. Look at Casey Russell with the run in the middle. Mendez right there though, sticking with him, not giving up on that inside. Three races to go. Mendez currently sits sixth in the standings, gained a position after Evergreen. He needs a top two for the rest of the season to have a shot at getting this title. He's right on board rear from Edwin Mendez. See Jacob Verhalt right there in the 23. He sits second in the standings, 27 points behind Christian Russell, who won Evergreen. Let's go back here side by side. Three wide right here. Leaf Barnett in the 01 in the middle. Manuel Gonzalez to the outside. Dylan Young on the inside in that 90 car. Chanel behind those guys watching. Let's try it on board with the 51. One more helmet cam here. Outside. Oh, we got a car around behind him as I saw in the rear view right there. Oh, and another car around. 51 and he saves it. That was Leif Barnett in the 01 who spins and another spin and save here. But some damage to his rear end. Caution is going to be out, I think. Yeah, it is. Caution flag is out. Raymond Fisher still your race leader. As I saw in the rearview mirror, I think it was Dwayne Singleton, he was, who got turned. And 51 with some damage to his left side. We're going to go back and see here. And it looks like Randy Mayhew just went up, and, or uh, Brandon Mayhew rather, went up and got into him. Man, now look at Scott just slammed that inside, or the outside wall rather. Singleton doesn't didn't really suffer much damage, but that's a hard hit from the 40 right there. None against Scott. And then right here, oh man, what a hit in the 51. Just looks like these guys kind of ran out of room, but not that big of a wreck. But still, some major damage to a lot of these guys. Raymond Fisher in the nine continues to lead the way here at Gateway. We'll be back. Welcome back here to Gateway for round number 10 of the Canon Pro Series Western Division. Three races remaining after this. Points are really tight as uh, Jacob Bahals has 27 points behind Christian Russell who leads the standings with 225 points. Getting ready to go back Green Fisher. He's third in the standings. A win would really help him here to try and get the title. Green flag is back out. And an equal start by everyone right there in the top 10 looks like. And Fisher, he kind of shot, sh overshot the corner right there. Now here comes the 59. And Casey Russell clears for the race lead. Three wide, Dylan Young going for third. Young doesn't have the run down a backstretch, but he's going to dive it into the corner once again. In the three and four they go. Russell driving really wide right there. It looks like he's just trying to get a run to stay ahead of these guys. Dylan Young not giving up on that inside line. Still looking for win number two. And Pujols and Mendez is going to clear the 90 while they go side by side for third. Henry Williams in the 57 showing up in the picture as well. There's Case, uh, Christian Russell who's been pretty quiet all night. As Casey Russell out front has taken the lead from Ramia Fisher. It'll be five laps to go this time by Fisher running a bit lower than he, um, that, the, than the race leader trying to get up there. There's a bit of contact between Mendez and Russell. As they go three wide, Williams to the inside. After what happened out there at Denver, Russell is not a fan of Henry Williams, who's in that red car right there behind him. About a 44 of Daisy Morgan quietly running up here in the top 10. He's going to go three wide now with Leif Barnett and Christian Elder in the 51. Four laps to go, this time by at the line. Leif Barnett trying to get the position as they go three wide down, or down the front stretch rather. Into corner number one they go. Look at that beautiful sunset off of there. They also three wide behind them. Brandon Mayhew in the 39 losing a couple positions right there. And looks like Morgan's going to submit that position to Christian Elder and Leif Barnett as we head back up front. It'll be three laps to go this time by. Fisher still has not found a way to catch the 59 as they've been kind of at a steady distance as you're right on board with the 9. 59 was a bit further ahead that time by. 
Jacob Pulse now up to third place. Fourth place, Dylan Young and Christian Russell back there in fifth. Lane Sand, or not Lane Sanders, uh, that's uh, the 57. There's Sanders back here with those guys. Morgan is kind of full out, full out of the top 10 now. Side by side, man that's going for the position from the 57 of Henry Williams, but is Morgan right there in the, in the 44? Two to go this time by for Casey Russell, still trying to keep ahead of the nine. Fisher has finished runner-up plenty of times this season. He does not want that to happen again, but he just cannot find a way around this 59. Both drivers looking for their first wins here this season, but Casey Russell looking for his first ever in the Western Series. Out of turn four, he comes. Casey, Casey Russell will see the white flag this time by at Gateway. He's running a bit lower than Fisher that time. Into the corners, out of two they go. Casey Russell, who has never won in the Pro Series at all, looking to close the deal here as he go into corner number three. It's been a while since Russell has won. The last time he won was over in the trucks. That was a while ago. But out of corner number four, Casey Russell captures this first ever Pro Series win. Casey Russell was able, was able to hold off Ramian Fisher right there for the win. And Fisher again is going to have to settle for second. And this is the fourth time this season he has finished a runner up. But still, it's a good points day for those guys. Along with Jacob Pahals, who finishes ahead of Christian Russell, who I believe got fifth. But Casey Russell, how about that? Capturing his first Pro Series win ever. Beating Ramian Fisher, Jacob Hall's third, Dylan Young fourth, and K uh, Christian Russell rather finishes fifth. Edward Mendez, Henry Williams, Arthur Xavier, Leif Barnett, and Christian Elder running out your top ten. But how about this for Casey Russell? It's been a really long season for them. A lot of bad luck and getting into other people's mess and all of that stuff. Getting wrecked and taken out and it all finally pays off for them as they captured their win here at Gateway. So, congratulations to Casey Russell on the win, his first Pro Series win altogether. Russell, who was fifth in the standings, this should be helpful for them now. But thank you guys for watching. Gateway does not have a um, victory lane, so we'll just get you to the standings, and we'll see you at an Orange Show.